We begin with breaking news out of Otay Mesa, where a body has been found in the water. I'm Heather Myers. I'm Carla Chiquetto. CBS 8's Kelly Hesedal joins us live from Otay with what she's learning. Kelly. That's right. You know, we're off of Otai Lakes, Road, just west of the skydiving school, and this is where a Border Patrol agent spotted a man's body in the water right around noon. Now, there are a lot of different agencies uh, that were involved in this one. Here's how San Diego Fire Rescue uh, described exactly where that body was located. Just right down below this embankment, uh, just on the water's edge, but kind of out where it drops off pretty fast. So once you go in the water, it's five to six feet. And that was Lieutenant Rick Romero, who says the body uh, was badly decomposed, that it appeared it had been in the water uh, for quite some time. So at this point, we don't know who this person was, the circumstances of what led up to all of this. We do have some video from Chopper 8 of this recovery process. So besides San Diego Fire Rescue, San Diego Police were out here. They had a canine with them. Uh, City Lake Rangers were out here. Border Patrol was out here as well. And I, actually, I'm told Border Patrol is out in this area quite a bit. Now, San Diego Fire Rescue crews put Put that body on a stretcher and pulled it up the embankment. Uh, but again, still a lot of questions about exactly how this person died. Uh, we have gotten a lot of rain recently. Uh, the lake is full. You know, this is an area people fish. People like to go boating out here. It's normally very peaceful. Uh, here's what else Lieutenant Romero told us. Part of it is just being able to bring closure to family. And hey, when someone calls us, other local agencies for stuff in the water. That's what our specialty is, and that's what we do to help out the rest of the local agencies. And the medical examiner's office uh, was out here a short time ago. They just left within the past uh, 30 minutes. Uh, they are going to be working on determining a cause of death as well as hopefully identifying this person. Uh, but again, a man's body was uh, pulled from the lake here in the Otai Lakes area. Uh, the medical examiner's office is now going to be trying to figure out exactly who that person was. Uh, we will continue to follow this story and bring you the very latest. Kelly Hesedal, CBS 8.